Okay, Comic 117. Okay, closing up for the holidays. Wanna ride home? Home? I am home. What? I sleep under the theater seats in a nest of old popcorn I've been collecting for years. Sweet mercy, that's awful. You're coming to live with me for a while, I insist. How soft is your popcorn nest? Okay, this was... I can't remember if this was a new thing or if this was kind of a midweek connection, but this was the new plot line where they realized that... And I'd forgotten until opening up this very comic, Jeff is, well, uh, to a lesser extent, homeless, but it's just the fact that he didn't ever bother looking for a home in the first place. So this is where the whole roommate thing starts out, because everyone starts having all these roommates go all the, over the place. This is where this comic stops being primarily about the theater and starts being more about their lives. So this becomes more of a Jeff and Kenny specifically Kenny narration. I mean, the, the the whole thing is all about Kenny. Kenny, who is supposedly me. So, not that this ever happened, that I found out that my f friend uh, just slept in a nest at his workplace, but I just thought this was sort of a continuation of Jeff's inability to live in the real world. <laughs> Which is why, you know, the character itself is perfect for going in and out of movies because he belongs in the movie world that's where he would get along cuz you don't you don't live anywhere if you're in the movie world you don't have a, a home an apartment uh you know you don't pay rent or things like that unless it's necessary to the plot just like you don't ever get hungry you don't ever need to go to the bathroom it doesn't it doesn't ever come up unless it's necessary to the plot so this is just sort of pointing out that for things that aren't necessary to the plot jeff He's not very good at them. Um, I think that's about it, aside from the fact that Kenny seems to be wearing a coat to go home which has a fur collar. Just rather uh, ostentatious of him, I must say. But that's just me. Um, I think that's about it. We're gonna, I, I want to find out where this goes, but I think this goes to kind of Kenny bringing him home and Jeff looking around and realizing that people have places to live and he doesn't quite understand it because obviously his first question about where Kenny lives is how soft is your popcorn nest <laughs> bringing it right back to the, to what he said immediately I don't know that's it's not really a throwback if it only happened one panel before maybe if the popcorn nest gag continues but I don't think I ever continued running gags beyond one comic, except for things like Sweet Mercy, but apparently I'm not the first one to do that. I should go back and count how many times I've said the word apparently in this one comic. No, I shouldn't. That's a waste of time. Uh, comic 118 tomorrow.